Hi, welcome to CPASS, CAPS Payroll's production accounting software. In this video, I'll be walking you through your computer's requirements to run CPASS in Google Chrome. Being a web-based application, CPASS requires no installation to run. Beyond programs needed for reporting like Adobe Reader, Microsoft Excel, and a printer driver, CPASS runs in any major web browser like Google Chrome, Mozilla's Firefox, Apple's Safari, or Microsoft's Internet Explorer. Considering Chrome for this video, as well as your operating system of choice, like Mac or Windows, there are a few minimum requirements and settings needed to run CPASS. Most of these items are easily met with modern personal computers, however, we recommend watching this video to verify that your computer meets the requirements and settings for CPASS to run smoothly. For Windows users, the minimum requirements to run CPASS are Windows 7 or higher, and an Intel-based Pentium computer with a minimum of 4 GB of RAM. Depending on your version of Windows, most of this information can be found by opening a folder browser window, finding your PC on the left-hand navigation tree, right-clicking, and selecting Properties. For Adobe Reader, search your program list under the Start menu. For Mac users, be sure your Mac is running OS X, or at least iOS 5 for mobile devices. This can be found by clicking on your Apple icon in the top left corner of the screen and selecting About This Mac. The minimum 4 GB of RAM can be seen here, and by clicking More Info, you will find the OS number, processor, and, when clicking Displays, the maximum available resolution. For all computers, the minimum screen resolution should be set to 1024 by 768, and your internet connection speed should be 1.5 megabits per second or faster. Most modern connections should be fast enough. However, if you're experiencing slowness, websites like speedtest.net can help determine if the cause is a slow internet connection. Using the most up-to-date version of Chrome is recommended. However, CPASS will work on some earlier versions as well. Additionally, a few plugins, add-ons, and other settings may help your browser support CPASS more efficiently. Most of these items will likely be part of the default settings, but it's a good idea to check. For the latest version of Google Chrome, the Google PDF Viewer should be enabled. Open a new tab, and in the address bar type Chrome colon forward slash forward slash plugins. In the list of plugins, set the Chrome PDF Viewer to enabled. Also, JavaScript and cookies should be enabled as well. This can be checked by going to the Customize and Control Google Chrome icon. Then Settings, Showing Advanced Settings, and under Privacy, click Content Settings. For Cookies, select Allow Local Data to be Set, and for JavaScript, set to Allow All Sites to Run JavaScript. Click Done. From here, click About to confirm you are running the latest version of Google Chrome. Regarding software, Microsoft Excel 2007 or later should be installed in order for CPASS to utilize the .xlsx format. If you are using Excel 2003 or earlier, Microsoft has compatibility packs available in the link here, as well as in the link provided in this video's description. For printers, HP's LaserJet series is required along with the PCL6 driver, which can be downloaded at the website of your printer. Lastly, if you prefer to view checks and reports in Adobe Reader instead of your browser's PDF viewer, please ensure you have the latest version installed. If you have any questions regarding system requirements or CPASS in general, the question mark icon displays the CPASS support team's number and email, a chat session, and knowledge base for quick answers.